6 9 is back to his old ways of trolling, and lately he has been going harder than ever. If you didn't already know, 6 9 is a marketing genius, and even though his trolling gets him more enemies and more hate, it's one of the main reasons that he is so successful. If you've been paying attention to 6 9s career, then you'll notice that every time he's about to release a new song, he first jumps on IG Live and he stirs the pot, starting beef with multiple other rappers. He has done this for every single one of his new songs, and he went pretty hard at these rappers recently, which caused a lot of them to fire back at 6 9 and react to the situation, which we will show you in today's video, so stay tuned. Also, don't forget to leave a like on this video if you are a fan of 6 9 and if you would like to join this month's giveaway of a brand new iPhone 11, then all you have to do is subscribe to the channel and watch this video until the end to find and comment the hidden message. Good luck. Now, once 6 9 snitched in court, so many people assumed that he put the final nail in the coffin on his career because they assumed that no one would support him and no other rapper would ever work with him again. Obviously though, as we have all seen, that has not been the case. 6 9 has already dropped two new songs out of prison, with the third one being dropped very, very shortly, and the attention that these songs have already received is insane. Gooba broke a YouTube record, and Trolls even went number one. And now, Yaya is expected to do even better than both of those songs, mainly for the reason that it is in Spanish, which we he will get that much more attention from his Spanish fans who will contribute very heavily to the views he gets, but either way, he's gonna have another song that blows up just as much, if not more than the first two. The attention he is getting has already made so many rappers mad. Probably a lot of them are very jealous, and 6 9 makes it even worse after he jumps on Instagram Live and calls out every other rapper and puts them on blast. Meek Mill has been going back and forth with 6 9 after Takashi attacked Meek Mill for hanging out with someone who was wearing a wire and has been working with the feds in the past. Meek Mill has had a lot to say back to 6 9 and this back and forth is going to be an ongoing beef that might get serious in the future the more 6 9 keeps going at it. Meek Mill is usually addressing 6 9 via Twitter, and you could tell by the way that he's tweeting at 6 9 you can tell that he's really getting under his skin, and having a new music video with Nicki Minaj definitely does not help the situation. 6 9 also went at Snoop Dogg with the same energy after showing documents and a video of Suge Knight exposing that Snoop Dogg was a snitch back in the day. Rat boy, you really better leave me alone. I ain't the one. No way. No way. Go on and do your shit and get out my way, bitch. Another thing that 6 9 addressed in his Instagram live videos that caused a lot of reactions was after he said that the King of New York is back. After he claimed that the King is back, he received some attention from Lil TJ and Rich the Kid. Both of them went back and forth with 6 9 but Takashi basically shut them both down. After Rich the Kid embarrassed himself by flexing a rented Lambo, that kind of ruined any argument that Rich the Kid had, and then he told Lil TJ that he will kiss his forehead because he's a little boy to him. So that caused some reaction because 6 9 is claiming he's the king of New York and he's back. Gucci Man also decided to jump in and voice his opinion. Gucci Man took to Twitter and he tweeted that he hopes all rats die of coronavirus in 2020. Although he didn't mention 6 9s name directly, he made it pretty obvious who that shot was directed at. See, I ain't drive my location. I ain't gotta relocate cause my car here. I ain't snitched on nobody. NLE Choppa has been voicing his own opinion, and he is one rapper who is getting very annoyed with the attention that 6 9 is getting. He decided to use this situation to his, to his advantage though. He's been promoting his music by voicing his opinion on Twitter, basically saying that he better get more love than a rat on his new song, Shot of Flow 5. Unfortunately though, that definitely did not happen because right now 6 9 has all the attention. Future was also a part of this attack after 6 9 went at him, but Future seems to be on a different wave. He's one rapper who decided not to go back and forth. He tweeted that he doesn't speak on people's business and he basically just left it at that. But knowing 6 9 6 9 feeds off of reactions. That's what he's aiming for every time he calls a rapper out. So obviously he didn't like that Future was being mature about it. And he had to throw in the final word after he commented Alexa play No Smoke by NBA Youngboy. So far, these are just some of the back and forths that have been happening since 6 9 decided to get back into his trolling ways. Recently, during a live with academics, he made a few comments about NBA Youngboy also, 
who might not speak on the situation, but if he does, that will definitely be some very entertaining drama in my opinion. One thing that's for sure though, is that the more attention 6 9 receives, and the more his music continues to break records, and reach spots on the charts especially, the more he's gonna get in his head, and the more he's gonna go off on rappers, and the more he's just gonna troll the internet and stir the pot. 6 9 shows no signs of slowing down with the trash talk, and Instagram live videos are going to continue popping up, especially when he's about to release a song, so we can pretty much assume that we will all be seeing much more beef with many more rappers in the near future, and we will keep you updated on all of this entertainment. To me it's entertainment, a lot of people don't like 6 9 stirring the pot, but I just kind of sit back and watch, I think it's hilarious. I do want to know where you stand on this whole situation. Do you think 6 9 is doing a little too much and that he should chill out a little bit? Or are you all for the drama, you just sit back and enjoy it? Let me know where you stand on all of this. Also, don't forget to leave a like on this video. If you are new to the channel, please subscribe. Mixed Ice Media, see you in the next one.